For today's spring break with Claudia video, I wanted to create a tropical inspired nail tutorial for you guys. Before applying on any nail polish, always be sure to apply on some base coats. The first nail polish that I'm going to be using is a bright yellow nail polish from OPI and I'm just going to apply this onto my ring finger and thumb. To achieve an even coat with this nail polish, I'm applying on two layers. Using a pastel green nail polish from Zoya, I'm going to apply this on the rest of my nails. I apply it on two layers with this nail polish as well. Once you're done with that step, your nails should look a little something like this. Then after that, I'm using a brown nail polish with a striping brush and I'm going to create crisscross lines on both of my yellow fingernails. This is going to represent the pineapples. Yum. And don't worry if your nails are not perfect because... Now I'm going to be using a dark green nail polish and with a dotting tool I'm just going to draw some leaves on the top corner of both my pineapple nails. Here is a fun fact that I bet a lot of you guys didn't know, but it actually takes almost three years for a single pineapple to fully mature and develop. Yeah. It's a long time. Now going back in with that dark green nail polish that we've been using and the striper brush, I'm going to create some palm tree leaves on the rest of my nails. And you can do this easily by drawing one line and then drawing little lines coming from the outside, like an upside down Christmas tree. And that is when my studio light fell on top of me because I was lying on the ground. And ta-da! That is how the nails turned out. Always be sure to apply on some... S oh wait, no, we're not done yet. <laughs> now I'm gonna go back in with the pastel green nail polish and my striper brush and just create some lines and texture on the pineapple leaves to give an extra touch. Then we go in with the top coat and apply that on all of our nails. And this will help to make sure that your design stays for as long as possible and your nails will not chip. And that is it for today's spring break inspired nail tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will see you guys for a new video very soon.